Today I'm showing you how to outline a person within Photoshop. This has become very popular with thumbnails. Begin by importing the image that you want to trace. Then from the list of options on the left, select the Quick Selection tool. Across the top, you'll see the option for New, Subtraction, or Addition of Selection. You can also change the selection of the size of the tool that you're actually going to be using. I have left mine smaller because it's more precise. Now that I've set the brush diameter, it's time for me to make a new selection. I'm selecting my image and I'm starting with my shoulder. It may not be the easiest to see, but I'm going to try and zoom in for you. Just keep dragging your mouse and it will start to include more sections into your selection. If you make a mistake and select too much, don't worry. All you have to do is hit the Alt key while holding down a selection and it will subtract it from your selection. It doesn't have to be perfect, but take your time to make sure that you get as many edges correct as possible. As you can see, I'm just working my way up my body so that all of my head and all of my hair is included in the selection. When you're finished, hit Command J and it will create a new layer with your selection. To see what it looks like without the old layer, go ahead and and click the icon on that layer so it is no longer visible. Once we've done this, we're halfway home. Now let's go ahead and finish it up. Make sure you have the new layer selected from the right, and then we're gonna go ahead and right click, and then we're gonna select blending options. From the menu on the left, select stroke, select the color for your outline, as well as how thick you want that border to be. And now you can see how it looks with the white outline around me, with the background and without. I'm deciding to use this image as my thumbnail, and I wanted to switch the words on my picture from one side to the other and I'm using Command T to resize the object of me. I think I'm pretty satisfied with the way that this thumbnail looks. I will use this as my thumbnail. If you guys learned something from this video, please give it a thumbs up and let me know you liked it. Leave a comment. Have a great day, guys.